welcome to my project ideas so in this particular video we will learn how to set up vs code visual studio code and you know implement sap ui5 application within it so it's like many people use different environment with different uh, uh, development tools for the application development and uh, like in past we might have used web ide or we might have used eclipse for development and nowadays people are using business application studio also but there are many times that uh, if you are using a free version of business application studio uh, the entire runtime expires in 90 days so it's, it means like you have to redevelop everything from scratch or you know, download the code if the, if the business application studio is deleted then you need to create a new account upload your old code there so it's better to use vs code and use free versions of uh, the extensions so the same thing we are going to do in this video will download and set up vs code and implement the extension of sap ui5 so this article i will share in the video also so i will just click on this particular link to download the vs studio first it is free and so we'll download it for windows and it is available for ios also so now the vs code is downloaded and now we can click and install it accept the terms and just install yeah you can launch also So once the VS code is installed, now we can proceed for the next steps. The very next thing that you need to install is Node.js. You can go to this link and install the stable version. In case you have already installed, you can always go to Windows R, type CMD, and you can write node minus V. It will give you the version of the node installed on a system. You can also write NPM minus V and it will also give you the version of uh, node modules installed over your system. Yeah. So now since the node is already installed for me, so I can proceed to the next step. But in case it is not installed for you, you can always go to this download tab and click the Windows MSI file installation. So I will skip this part and uh, we can proceed to the VS code setup. So I will jump to VS code and if you see we have multiple options over here and the last section is extension and you see we have something called sap fury tools and if you see these are all officially provided by sap itself right and we'll install it out by clicking on installing and it is installed now since we have already installed uh, the Fury tools application modeler so now we'll do control shift plus p and you can see the very first option that is fury open application generator so you can write fury colon open application generator and you will see a pop-up here in order to use application generator you have to install it out So I will try to install the SAP tools extension pack. It will allow me to, you know, perform a lot of things using extensions. So once the extension is installed, you can see this uh, option will op open up automatically. And that is explore and install generators. So I'm going to install the very first that is generate uh, Fury. So once the generator for Fury is installed, you will be able to perform exactly same steps that you perform over business application studio. It's like click on on basic and creating your next, you know, applications and all data sources for O data. You can keep the view name, whatever you want. And 
since it is our test development so we'll just click on finish so once the dependencies are installed so it will you know create a project for you automatically with the name of the project that you have just defined and it will open up here and you can see all the content that is being created for you so to open up the project you need to click on open folder and you can see the folder where everything is installed for me for in terms of vs code so it's like you can see the few tools you can see the vs code you will also find something called projects and inside it you will see the project one and i will just add it out so now you can see that uh, the entire ui5 model is over here so i will open the first view and i will call the title as test project for vs code demo okay you can just press ctrl s and once you are done with that right click here preview application and then click on start fury run here you can do start local run and allow wherever it asks the question to allow so since we need you know node.js here to run the application and it will install the missing packages for ui5 and then it will start running your local server you see the local server is running on 8080 and you can see that in browser also so if you see the test project for vs code demo is running over your local server so in this way you can install vs code you can install the extension for uh, ui5 and then you can install a generator and using the generator you can create a project and then you can open your file editor the project folder and run the file directly like this so since you have vs code so you don't need business application studio anymore so in the next video we'll see how to connect a github using vs code for sap ui5 application development thank you